As Alberto Jones and company look to complete a run to the 5A state championship game for a second straight year. In order to do so, Ellison would have to take down Veterans Memorial out of San Antonio. Got off to a good start though. Nashawn Parker, nice spin and move into the layup. Part of a 5-0 start for the Eagles right out of the gates. And then Jojo McIver would start to take over. He spins and finishes with the right-handed floater to give his team a lead at the end of the first quarter. And then how about this shot? In terms of difficulty. Defenders all around, doesn't matter. Beats the halftime buzzer for three as Ellison heads into the break with a 14 point lead and vibes are high amongst the fans on the sidelines. Third quarter more from MacGyver. Misses the first shot from the mid range, but good perseverance from the Eagles. They hit the offensive boards, gets it back out to MacGyver. He cans the three, can't give him two opportunities. He finishes with a game high 23 as Ellison goes up 18. Fourth quarter, putting the nail in the coffin. Duran leaks the three. Eagles up 21 and the run continues. Ellison headed the 5A state championship game once again with a 59 to 47 win. I thought it was huge. You know, like we had the three guys. We got three guys back and I mean only three, but those three they've been locked in and had a goal all, all year and those other guys have been following their lead. So, I, I mean, I was proud of it, but it didn't surprise me because they've been locked in. After we lost to Shoemaker, it fell out the rankings. After that, I just seen a different team. They just kind of been locked in and were peaking at the right time. Just to be able to get back to this point, it's, uh, it's a pretty good feeling, but can't get too excited because we got one more.